Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm April Honey. Today we are going to be working on a quick speed build for Bones on my Forever Island. We're going to be giving him a little farm to table action going on over here. I cannot wait to show this to you, so let's get started. So Bones House is located directly next to the farm on my island. The farm is my museum hidden behind a farmhouse that we built. And I really do love this area of my island. It's actually one of my favorite areas. And I just wanted to make a little area here where villagers would come and sit and eat and enjoy the atmosphere with friends and food, you know, what? But what better things are there in life than friends and food? I just think those are the best things ever, right? So I'm gonna put a variety of chairs around it because I don't like the super matchy matchy everything. I tend to use different chairs just to add a little bit of just a difference. I put my wheelchair here because I want to sit with my villagers and enjoy the atmosphere with them and hang out with them. And of course we put some natural friends in. Of course we have a teddy bear. The piggy is going to get into the food because you know he's a farm animal too. Over here I wanted to put a little salad bar in case anyone wanted some to get up and get themselves uh, some food. And then I think we're going to put a baby high chair here because that's been basically the story of my life for a long time. I have babies, you know? So of course Bones needs a mode of transportation. That seemed as good a place as any to park his bike and the rest of it we're just going to fill out right here with some nature. I wasn't too thrilled with the way this path was going, so I did move it over and um, just get it a little bit restructured. I don't know, it, I just wanted it further away from the table and I wanted that high chair to sit on something that wasn't a path. So that's what we ended up going with. I think it came out uh, good. And then back here, I wanted to put some stalls. I ended up using the cover counter instead of stalls I just think that they ended up working really well for this area right here and this is all also in front of the orchard bones also has the orchard behind him so I felt like this kind of little eating area was perfect for his house with the farm next to him and the orchard behind him it all made sense you know and we like things that make sense the rest of this is just whatever I felt looked good and then we're going to throw down some flowers because it's not a build on my island without some flowers. Of course I was looking at the area right over next to me and I was like you know I really want to put a duck over there because I cannot resist the call of the ducks. So we went ahead and stuck a puddle over here and put a decoy duck because I don't know, I've been using the toy ducks everywhere and I like them, but the de duck decoy just seemed like a better choice right here. I don't know. It probably doesn't really matter because I'm going to put a bunch of toy ducks everywhere else anyway, so I don't know that it truly really mattered, but again, I digress. It is what it is. We're going to put a few more flowers and I think we're almost done with this build. It was just a short, sweet, and simple, and if you're looking for some very simple ways to decorate your villagers house this is a good way to do it it's nice it's natural it's very easy and hopefully you guys enjoyed it i really enjoyed building it i hope you all have an amazing day i know you can be anywhere in the entire internet and you chose to hang out with me for just a little while and i appreciate you so much for that i'll see you guys in the next one bye